In this video, I'm going to show you how to attach elastic to a waistband using a serger. And this is my pretty model today. So I have a piece of fabric that I have already hemmed. I also have a piece of elastic that I already know the size of her waist. And also I'm using the elastic foot for my serger. First of all, you want to unscrew this screw slightly because you want to feed your elastic in between this section here. Now, just be very careful because this can come off very easily. So only unscrew it slightly so you can move this about. As you can see, the mouth of this foot opens and closes, and this is so it allows your elastic to feed in between. So as you can see, I've thread my elastic through, and it's better if you just slip it to one side here. It can be quite fiddly, but you'll get there. And just tighten it slightly to the width of your elastic. Now tighten this screw up and it'll stop this from sliding about now that we have set our elastic into place. Now just pop your foot onto your serger. My machine is set to a four thread overlock. I'm going to feed the unhemmed end into my serger. I've started it off and I'm now going to increase the tension onto my elastic. As you can see, we now have the elastic attached to the waistband of our skirt. I am now going to fold it over like so, and I'm going to take it over to my sewing machine. And as I stretch the fabric, I am going to sew a straight stitch. So I'm just going to set the first few stitches in place before I start tugging. and back stitch and now we're going to start stitching all the way along you folded it over and you're just going to stretch it now once you've got the past the back here you're going to have something to hold on to and then you're going to start stretching it as it goes through your sewing machine and you can just keep stopping readjusting your hands and then continuing on. You don't have to do everything all in one go. So adjust your hands, make sure everything's straight and flat. It's a little bit fidgety, it's probably going to take a few attempts, but you'll get there. Once you've folded the skirt section over, you're then going to fold each two sides, right sides together, and then you're just going to join these two ends together.
And here you go, one skirt with an elasticated waist. You can make this for you or a doll. It's exactly the same method. And here she is in her new skirt. And I apologise right now if you're going to have to make these for your daughter or your grandchildren or your nieces. They are super quick. If you've enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up so people like you can find me. And don't forget to hit the subscribe so you don't miss seeing me next week. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.